Alright, so what is up, y'all? It's Legendary EA back here for a new series, the Denver Nuggets with the updated rosters. Now, if you guys are a Timberwolves fan, just hold on. This is not a full blowing all series. This is just going to be a filler series because I can't upload the, the Timberwolves every single day. I kind of want to mix it up every once in a while. And another team that I really wanted to do were the Denver Nuggets. Now, they just traded Ty Lawson to one of my favorite teams, the Houston Rockets. So, yo, this is going to be fun. This is going to be a real rebooting process and I'm gonna keep it how some of you guys would say realistic I'm not gonna come out here and make crazy blockbuster trades get a bunch of crazy rookies and all that type of stuff that I normally do I'm gonna make this series realistic and yo I hope you guys enjoy it but for the next episode you guys let's get 200 likes for the next episode this series is gonna be fun and I'm gonna keep it realistic with, with you guys in this episode I probably will make like one one trade and it's probably not even gonna be a big one to be honest but looking at my team, ah, this team has a salary cap issue, man. We got Gallinari making like 14 mil a season. We got Wilson Chandler making 11 million. We got Randy Ford making 3 million. Now Wilson Chandler's making, he's making 11 million dollars off the bench. But look at, look at this. We had to go and fire Melvin Hunt. And you know what? We're gonna be real with them. We're gonna keep this shit blunt, straight up. We're gonna keep it real. We're gonna just straight up real with them. You are terminated, fool. Bye bye. Yes. And here are his responses, okay. So we are all cool with that. And somebody who we're looking at hiring is somebody younger, somebody better at their job. Look at his stats, they're ass. So we go ahead and we hire Michael Goodrich. Hopefully he brings something to the team. I'm not gonna give him a long contract, but hopefully he can make something happen. But yo, I hope you guys are enjoying this series. I'm really gonna enjoy this one. I'm gonna keep it realistic. I don't want my team to be crazy good like my Timberwolves are. I want this to be fun. And then we also get William Goodrich. This is crazy. They have the same last name. I didn't even notice that when I was recording. But we get those two as in our coaching staff. So we did try to get Willie Colley Stein, the number one person who we actually went for. Look, I'm not really going after big players. The main person in this is Ben McLemore. The first thing I did, I wanted to get Kelly Oubre. I know I said I was going to go after crazy rookies, but he's really a low rated rookie, to be honest. He's really low rated. But what they wanted for him, that was unrealistic. They wanted my whole team. I was offering them a crazy ass deal. A crazy deal, which virtually I was getting robbed. They said, hell no. I, I, I was all right, all right, good for you guys. So somebody else we were thinking of getting is Danny Green. Now, I believe this trade is realistic. I haven't asked people in my Skype chat uh, with that online leak if this was realistic. Most of them said, yeah, this is pretty realistic. It's a fair trade regardless. So this is the trade that I'm gonna be going with. I'm trying to get Danny Green and Kyle Anderson I basically threw Kyle Anderson in, but look at everything we were offering them. A first round pick in 2018, which really is not going to mean anything to me, to be honest. And I do not want to use any VC on this one. I want to keep this thing real. I want them to actually accept this trade. But one player we, need, we really need to get rid of is Randy Ford. He's 31, and his progression is just going down. We also threw in a rookie from, I believe, Bosnia, Serbia. It was one of the two. We have two of those rookies. And I really want to get rid of... Uh, Nick Johnson is cool now. I still want to get rid of him. But I really want Danny Green and Kyle Anderson. If I can get those two players, I would be happy. And this is really realistic, to be honest, because, yo, Danny Green, even though he's a big part of the Spurs offense, he's not really that important. But look, we give up Randy Foy, 2018 pick, along with those two players. And Jameer Nelson, I'm happy he's off my team. Now, when I first started this my GM, my instinct was to maybe bring back J.R. Smith. And I was like, hell no, nah, hell no, nah, hell no. Nah. I don't, I don't want to do that. I don't want to deal with him. I already got rid of him on my team with my GM. But this is our starting center. I've never heard of this guy, but apparently he's kind of cold with, with those rebounds. His rebounding rating is like a 90. So I'm going to have to stick with him for right now. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope you guys leave a like and a comment. Make sure you get 200 likes again for the next episode. Our number one scoring option is, of course, Gallinari. Then, <laughs> then it's Danny Green. And then he made it Moutier. Moutier does not have the best shot. So... Developing this team is going to be good. Let me know of any trades you guys want me to make in the comment section below. Do you guys want me to trade Gallinari because of his huge contract and his low and his low efficiency? Let me know in the comment section below. But yo, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on Twitter at Listen to your EA2. This series is going to be realistic, you guys. So list some comments, list, list some trades and all that in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace, y'all.